What's up guys, it's Bisho. Welcome back to another video. Today we are having another unboxing video. Now the last unboxing I did was on the CM Storm Devastator keyboard, uh, which is pretty good for its cheap price. I mean, it's still doing pretty well right now. I mean, there's nothing wrong with it. But uh, for this unboxing video, I'll be doing it on the Razer Kraken. Uh, I just bought this uh, today uh, over at Best Buy. That was around 67 bucks. And it is a pretty popular headset around uh, the community uh, at the moment. But um, I'm sure many of you guys have heard of the Razer Kraken as a uh, really nice uh, headset. But of course there are others that are probably better or cheaper than this. Uh, but it's just uh, this uh, thing has a lot of good reputation along with it throughout uh, a lot of people. I mean, I've talked to some of my friends and they've recommended this uh, as a very good headset. Although it may not be the best for its money price. But 67 bucks, I could spare it. And... Uh, I got this, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, pop this open. This is a stereo 2.0 headset, and uh, let's see what we can do. So there's a tab at the bottom over here. We'll just go ahead and pry this thing open. Oh, there we go. Uh, I do have a cold right now, uh, so if I do sniff or cough or anything of that sort, uh, I will apologize in advance right now. So, all right, so pretty easy to take off the little cover thing right here. So just lay that aside right there. We have this little plastic container right here uh, containing the headset. You can see half of it right now. Let's see how we can get this thing open. Um, now, I don't really unbox brand new things often. Uh, you see, my dad's normally a cheapskate and likes to uh, take things on sale, but this is one of those few exceptions along with the Razer, I mean the uh, CM Storm Devastator. Uh, so, this is fresh out the box if I can get this thing open. Alright, there we go. Alright, so we pried this thing open, this little tab right here. Now we should be able to lift this out, I believe. Is it still stuck somewhere? Oh, there's probably a tab right here. Right, well, we'll just pry this thing open, whatever. Uh, Alright, there we go. That's one side, and then the other. If we can get this, there we go. Alright, I don't really want to break this cover thing because I need to put this back together because I like to keep the casings of my stuff. It's like there's some tape on the top. I'll go ahead and just take that out. Alright, there we go. So let's go ahead and take this thing out. If we can. Let's just try it this way. Alright, there we go. Here's the headset. We'll go ahead and uh, throw it over there. Uh, so now we got some more tape we need to get through. We'll go ahead and take this thing off. Alright, there we go. There's that piece of tape. Now hopefully that's the last one we're going to have to go through and deal with. And now all we need to do is pry this thing open. And hopefully... Almost there, I do believe, or maybe we are there. I just need to figure out how this box works because right now I'm having a bit of trouble with this. Maybe we can just slide this thing out. That seems to be working for now. We'll just take this thing out. All right, we'll set that aside right there and let's see if we can get this headset out now. Sorry, you guys can't really see much, but I'm trying to get this thing out right now. Um. Having a bit of trouble right now, as you can see, this is the inside of the headset right now. I'm just trying to get this thing open. Alright, and there we have it. We have the headset finally out of the box. Let's take a look what's inside of here. It's a little bit of instruction manual. It says, congratulations, there's no turning back sound, whatever. Uh, looks like we got ourselves a razor sticker over here, so that's pretty cool. I might stick that somewhere in my room uh, Just for the lols or something, but uh, I'll get, definitely keep this handy uh, In case I want to put that anywhere, but looks like this is the instruction manual, but it's a headset I mean come on. I'm pretty sure everybody knows how to work that but here's the actual headset uh, It's green so green is one of my favorite colors, so I'm happy about that uh, so I'm surprised the cable isn't, uh, what's it called, matted or braided like other ones, like the uh, Razer Death Adder, how the cable is, uh, it's, I don't know, it's braided? I'm, oh well, I'll just go with that, but here's the cable right now, it looks like it has an adapter so it can go into PCs or things like that, and the, uh, there it is, there's the, uh, the microphone, it's retractable so I can just pull this out. So, I've heard the microphone quality was really good, so this is definitely one of the reasons why I picked this thing. Uh, so, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and, oh, looks like these things can fold up too. That'd be really useful for storage, so. Yeah, that's pretty awesome. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put it on now to see how it feels. Alright, so, first impressions, very comfortable. 
Like the uh, leather paddings on the side of the ears are really, really comfortable. And a little bit hard on the head, but I'm sure I'll get used to that later. But yeah, this cable is going to be really long, so I can definitely hook this up to my PC almost anywhere. And I'm pretty sure I can use this uh, when I listen to music on my iPod, so that's also a plus. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm going to go ahead and try to test the microphone uh, and see how the audio quality is right now. But um, yeah, that's pretty much it for this unboxing. Here's the Razer Kraken as it is right now. I'll be using this for the rest of my videos, uh, so that's that. Here's my previous headset. This is a Logitech G230, and it's kind of broken. So now the reason why I got this headset, this Razer Kraken thing right here, is because uh, my old headset it still works and all, but the actual structure of it is broken. Uh, I should probably think of the words. This thing right here, uh, the um, I, don't, I don't know if you guys can see this right here, but. That's all super glue right around here. Uh, this thing snapped and uh, I decided to super glue it and after a couple of months it just kept uh, breaking and yeah, I was, I was just fed up with it. I mean, to wear it I had to push this thing into the hole and then I had to put it on and then every time I did put it on it would just keep on cracking. And in fact, if you guys will take a look at in there, you guys probably won't be able to see it around here. Uh, there are already cracks starting to form, and the other side is probably going to end up just like this and uh, just break in. Yeah, I'm not dealing with that, so <clears throat> I'm still going to keep this handy just in case something happens to the Kraken. But yeah, I'm going to be using this baby now on. So um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this video, head it with thumbs up. And uh, I'm pretty sure that's it. Peace.